What's up, YouTube? And what you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to day three of our Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon Hype TCG Video Week. That's a huge title. Anyway, like I said, today is day three. If you missed days one and two, we've opened up a shiny Sil Valley box. We've opened up a Zorark GX box. You're gonna want to check both of those out. Today's video is going to start a series of the Crimson Invasion Booster Box. I'll explain that in a second, but we are doing these videos because we are hyped for Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, which comes out on Friday. That's four days from when this video goes up, and I can't wait. If you don't know, we are going to be doing a, a, a Let's Play of that, and it's going to be absolutely insane, amazing, fun. I hope you'll come back and join us for that. Uh, but anyway, like I said, today's video we're going to be opening up a Crimson Invasion booster box. Now I know this set hasn't been so great for us, but that's okay. I like some of the cards that are in here, so it, it, it's okay. It's going to be nicer to us as we go forward. Now this was purchased from Pokeballs. I will leave his link in the description, assuming I remember. I don't always remember links in description of TCG videos. Um, but you definitely want to check him out because he's selling cards and he has the best prices, etc, etc. Thank you for sending me this if you do wind up checking out the video. I hope you enjoy. Um, now, with a booster box, since we don't open too many booster boxes, you know, we're not to a point in our channel that I think it makes sense to open multiple booster boxes um, because I can't open like a thousand packs in one video. So it's just not really worth it to open too many boxes. We're going to explain this, like I said, into four videos. So we're going to do each of the pack arts. Today we're going to be opening up Guzzlord. Tomorrow we're going to open up Savali. Yeah. Uh, Wednesday we're going to open up Buzzwole. And Thursday we're going to open up Kartana. Here's what I need you to do. I want you to take a guess in the comments below of this video which one you think is going to have the most pulls. The most just general pulls. Doesn't have to be anything special. I think over the four days we might try and do something, but if you guess it right, I might slide you a code. And I might really slide you a code, especially if you're subscribed, so make sure you subscribe if you're not. Let's go ahead and jump to the pack cam where you can see this Crimson Invasion booster box. And like I said, I don't get to do this often. So let's take a read. The mysterious Ultra Beasts have arrived, invading the Alola region as Crimson Tinged, whoa. Crimson Tinged Pokemon GX Nihilego, Buzzwool, Kartana, and the Ravenous Guzzlord GX. Can Silvali and the other allies of Alola defend the islands, or will the Ultra Beasts take control? Find out when you battle, blah blah blah, blah blah blah. So these red GX, as they're called, as we break into this, whoa. Don't go anywhere, microphone. Anyway, they're pretty wild. Like, some of them are like, your opponent has two more prize cards. Some of them are like, when this Pokemon KOs, or it's the GX attack, that it does like, no? I don't remember, but uh, Guzzlord somehow takes three prize cards in one. So um, now this video is gonna have the setup as we split this into nine videos. So bear with me while we chat about this for a while. Now I've seen some people who their pulls have not been the best. Uh, I've heard of some people whose pulls have not been the best with this set. And it's very unfortunate that that would happen. Very unfortunate that the Pokemon company would... Some people are getting like four pulls per box. Some people are getting like three pulls per box. Also, I don't remember previous boxes being completely... Well, I guess we can leave this out. Uh, I don't remember other sets, other booster boxes having it to where... It would go one, two, three, four, like that just did. If you saw me sorting those out, every single pack was in the order of this. So, what what's going on? What's going on, Pokemon Company? You're better than this. You're better than this. But this box is pretty much going to determine how we handle Pokemon uh, Crimson Invasion going forward. I'm not a huge fan right now. Maybe I'll become a, be a bigger fan. So here we have our nine Guzzlord packs. We're going to go ahead and shuffle them up. But I've heard, like, apparently sides of the box were uh, were heavier than other sides of the box. Some people have gotten, like, seven pulls per box. Knowing us, we're probably going to have one of those three or four pull boxes. And 
That's why I'm opening up this, I'm opening this up last. So here goes pack number one, our Guzzlord GX. So again, you gotta let me know in the comments below which one you think is gonna have the most pulls. And I'd prefer if you could do it like fairly, you know what I mean? Uh, how do I wanna do this? I guess we'll put it back in. Oh, I remembered to flip it over before moving the, moving the code card. All right, we're gonna start off with a fire energy. Oh. All right, so I, I don't have a guess as to which one's gonna have the most. I just want I just want some pulls. So here we go. Here we go. Ooh, an Agron, a Hollow Agron. I have not seen that card. You know why I haven't seen that card? Because the pre-release kits were garbage. This whole ooh, I probably shouldn't be talking down this set while I'm opening it, but I just it's really silly to me that you can open a booster box and own like 36 packs and only get three pulls. That's wild. I'm gonna go with a metal energy. Ooh. I wound up having to face, I, I said this in one of our, uh, in one of our videos, in one of our pre-release videos, that I faced a Guzzlord. And what the guy did is he did one Guzzlord and 39 energies. So he was guaranteed to have his Guzzlord. And then by turn three, he had won the game because Guzzlord's GX attack, I think, uh, has you pull, has you draw uh, three prize cards when you knock out a Pokemon. All right, let's go with a Fighting Energy. Oh, there was the Metal Energy I called last time. All right, now this is gonna be very strange opening it up this way since I don't normally open booster boxes this way. Uh, it's very possible that there could like not be any pulls for a video or two. I'm a little nervous because normally, you know, when you open a booster box, you go about four or five packs and you're like, okay, this one's going to be the pull. Not necessarily. Now, as I've said in all the videos that I've done in the last three months, Sun and Moon has not been nice to us. Um, we have not been able to pull anything above a... Uh, GX in a long time. And I don't know if I'm going to count this set, but I'm going to go with a Fairy Energy. I am one off. Anyway, I don't know if I'm going to count this box because, like, you know, you're supposed to get all of those pulls in a box. But that's assuming that we're even going to get anything above a GX, and I don't, I don't know how I'm feeling about that. But I guess we'll find out. Speaking of which, does that break the curse? I hope this breaks the curse. Hyper Rare Alolan Executor. Whoa. 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 I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. Let's keep it going. Hold on. I haven't really looked at these. Hey, stay back. So, what do we have? Because I didn't do a review of this set. Attack does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to this Pokemon. To this po what? Attack does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to this Pokemon to one of your opponent's Pokemon. That's not bad, is it? I don't think that's bad. I don't think that's bad at all. All right, Guzzlord, let's go. Guzzlord's on the Guzzlord is on the board with one. Nice and one. Whoops. Well, I'm sure I'll get it eventually. All right, let's go with a... Oh, what did we just pull? A dragon. Never mind. I'm going to go with the grass energy. Okay. All right, let's, let's, let's get it back. We, we, we kind of got distracted there for a little bit. Again, since I haven't pulled a hyper rare, I mean... I pulled a uh, Lycanroc Midday form in August. Before that, I couldn't even tell you what the last time I pulled. Like, I don't even know what the last time I pulled a Hyper Rare was. I have no idea. If you know, for some reason, I don't know why anybody would know that watches this, but 
Uh, let me know what the last Hyper Rare I pulled was. If you want to go back and watch all of them, I'll give you a code. Uh, let's go with a... Uh, I have Water Energy. I don't know. When you open 36 packs, like, your energy guesses get less, uh, less diverse. Start saying the same thing all over and over and over and over again. Oh, while... Ooh, and a Guzzlord Full Art. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, you better change your vote now. You better go click that edit button. Whoops. You better go click that edit button. I see you, Jimmy. Jimmy. Don't you, don't cheat, Jimmy. Jimmy, stop. Don't need to cheat. I have, I have a lot of codes. All right, that's a hyper rare and a full art all in one. My group chats are going nuts. So all I see on my uh, pack cam right now um, are notifications at the top of the screen, but I don't think you'll see any of, any of those. All right, let's go with a dark energy for our Guzzlord. I am one energy behind every single time I say something. So far, I'm pretty happy. If we can pull four GXs out of the last, however many we have left, this box will, I will be extremely happy with this box. Hey, sunlight, I need you. I need you, sunlight, come back. Come back to me, sunlight. I always keep a booster box of, of pack codes, or of pack arts, as you can see if I show you up here. You can see all of those over there. Also, you still see that Roaring Skies box that I haven't opened. Maybe I should open that since Jamin's kind of going out. But uh, how about... Grass. Ooh, that's our first correct guess. This Guzzlord video. This Guzzlord video is going all the way in. It's going all the way in. Anything? 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 Ah, uh, just a... Place a clay army. All right, last pack for this video. I'm pretty happy with this. I mean, I've got a Lowland Executor is awesome. Um, Guzzlord is, I mean, he's my least favorite, and that's why we're opening him first. But that's okay. That's okay. Okay. All right, let's go with um, fire. There's a lot. It seemed to be a lot of water in this be a lot of water in dang mo oh i like me some dang mo oh counter energy interesting card i would also love to pull up wow okay so if you didn't vote cuzlord probably lost but you should still leave a comment below because you never know what kind of mood i'm gonna be in and since i don't play tcgo that often never know Anyway, let's recap. So, to start off the video, we had an Alolan Executor Hyper Rare. Look at that. Freaking awesome. Followed that with a Guzzlord GX Full Art. That Red GX Ultra Beast. That's really cool. So, it says, if your opponent's Pokemon is knocked out by damage from this attack, draw, draw two more prize cards. Wild. And then we had an Nihilego GX card. So if you wound up enjoying part three or day three of our uh, Ultra Sun Ultra Moon Hype TCG videos, go ahead and hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you tomorrow for the Sil Valley, yeah, for the Sil Valley pack arts in this Crimson Invasion box. But until then, have a blessed day.